hi guys you welcome back to my youtube channel in today's tutorial i'm going to be showing us two different methods on how you can fade your background using pixel lab so before we proceed with today's tutorial if you're not subscribed to my youtube channel make sure you subscribe to my youtube channel turn on the notification bell icon so i will post a new video you'll be notified so we'll proceed with the tutorial so right now i'll, I'll click in this place so I'm, the picture I'm going to be using, I'll be using directly from my gallery. So to fit in the background, instead of me importing the image, so I will not have to resize it again to fit in the to fit in the background. So I'll click on gallery from my gallery. Then I'll, I'll proceed to select the picture I want to use. You can use a wrap picture. Then I just have to scroll down. I'll tap on this picture. This is the picture I want to use. I'll tap on it. So this is it. I'll click here. I'll, I'll delete the text. All right. So right now, so what you're gonna do it is for you to bring in a shape. So remember the aim of this tutorial it is for us to blend our background or the image. So you click on shapes. Here you click on shapes. You tap on the shape. Once you tap, once you tap on the shape, let us uh, adjust it a little bit. So you scroll down. You're gonna see gradient. You click on gradient. You click you, you you're going to tap on this um, plus sign you tap on the plus sign then this place here you tap on this place so you, it, it's going to be at the horizontal level so you tap on this place here you click on it and then you're going to adjust this you the, the hue you adjust it to 132 this is it 132 here then you adjust this to this other part you click on the ok then you can drag this to the center to fit in whatever place you want it to be so you put it here then you click on ok so ok here now you can change you can use this to rotate it you adjust it adjust it then you gonna screw like this and then you put it on the color you enable the color you can see that the background is faded already uh, the, the image so if you want the background like you want this uh fade this the, this fading effect if you want it to be like to take the color of the background also as well so what you're going to do it is for you to click on this plus sign again and then this part that is here you click on it then you're going to use this good saw to look for this uh color here so you get it now so this here is the color so you tap on it like this you get it so you can either um, maybe increase it to look for the main color you want or you can just leave it like this then you, you tap on it now you can see hope you, you hope you can see the magic now so this is it now we've, we've already gotten a what a faded background this is the word the first stage the first step on how you can fade your background you can see you cannot see so you can easily change change the the, the color to whatever color that you whatever color that you want to use so you can um you get it now you, you can see we've already what we've changed the 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 fading color so we proceed to the other step this is the other step we're going to be using right now Uh, this is the second step you're going to be using so also we are going to bring in a shape also as well so you you are going to tap here you bring in a shape so you let's increase a little so this one is a bit different is different from the first one we did now you increase your this stroke width just screw down you you're going to see stroke width i'm going to put it at 25 or 26 okay let's put it at 25 so you scroll down again you're going to see blur radius so you, you are going to increase this blur radius to 25 then when you tap on this ok sign then you 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 are going to go to color okay and go to color you put the color you enable the color like this and then you put the color white it depends on the fading color that you want so you go to uh, you, you you're going to okay this shadow you go to shadow then you add your shadow like this you enable it and then you go to the color you're going to increase increase this blur radius 
in the shadow to 25 also as well so you you click on the ok and then you go to inner shadow you name with inner shadow you go to the color you select the color that you want you click on this white then you're going to increase it to 25 like this so now let us see so you you're going to increase this also as well so it can fit into the uh image at the background now you can see now if you see very well yeah there is a noticeable line in this uh uh in this shape that we brought in to fade this image so what we're going to do right now it is for us to go to our opacity our opacity so we are going to use the opacity to remove um this line so we'll make it uh, look a little bit fainted so we are going to use this this look at that tab here opacity and then you we are going to drag it like this like this like this like this so put it at zero okay let's leave it at one or two so now you can see the background is what the background is faded so you can easily use this to fade your, your background on pixel lab so it depends on the color but in this very one i did now it is not compulsory that you must use white you can use whatever color that you want to use but if you want to use another color that is to say you're going to do reversals as well just like for instance you, you tap here like this then you come back again you go to shadow then you're going to change your shadow to this also as well now you you you, you see the magic you see what i just did like this so now you what will fade that background so that's just the easy step and the easy guide on how to fade your background on pixel lab so if you, you if you be finding this difficult um for you or you'll be trying to do this uh, for a long time and you've not been able to get it correctly so this is the easy step and this is the easy guide you can take in order for you to uh, fade your image on pixel lab thank you for watching and make sure you subscribe to my youtube channel please subscribe to my youtube channel and make sure you turn on the notification bell icon as we are going to be uploading new videos on how you can um, design and do some tricks with Pixel Lab. Thanks for watching.